In this video, I'm going to show you how you can create a logo with the Pokemon font, either generated online in just a few seconds, or you can install the font on your computer for free and then make the logos on whatever you use, Photoshop, Gimpy, Gimpsy, forgot the name. Let's get started. So to get the font, we're going to go to fontbolt, fontbolt.com. And then we're going to search for Pokemon, Pokemon, or you can go directly to the link. I'm going to leave the link in the description so you can just go directly to the font in case you can find it. So here we have the Pokemon font. These are the two variations that they have available. So we can make the logo with this one or with this one. You can see that this one is a little thicker. So this is where we can generate it online. Then I'm going to explain how to download them and install them in the computer so we can use it in Photoshop. Let's go down to the generator. Down here is the main editor. Can I zoom in a little? Yes. Okay, let's play around with it. So basically here you're gonna type in the text that you want to. I am Taco Latino, so I'm gonna write something like Poke Bola. Poke Biola, bro. Poke Bola, and then I'm gonna choose the font. So here we have even more fonts available. So I'm just gonna choose the basic one and then click generate. As you can see, here we have basically the text generated immediately. So I'm gonna <laughs> uh, select your mama and we have a huge logo right there so let's select some styles so basically you have the basic style the pokemon style but you can mix it in with other things like super mario colors for example so it takes the font and then applies that specific style so we have the netflix font also it's just basically taking the pokemon font and then applying the netflix logo style to them i find that pretty cool so i'm gonna choose the color if i want it for example blue and then if you want a different background then you can basically choose it from here in the background section so i'm gonna choose this green that my wife loves and generate that does not look good so i'm gonna go with the super mario style just choose this blue and then where's the mario thing it was right here super mario style oh it didn't choose the background select that style generate perfect i have my logo with my text and it looks great so i'm going to download the image right here from this button you have the cloud button so i'm going to click download and as you can see just saved it on my computer so i'm going to check my downloads open the folder and this is my image i'm going to open the image and this is my logo generated in a few seconds so as you can see here we have a little bit of um how do you call it crispin uh, no it's called a pixelation pixelation so generating the text online works well if we want to do some meme or something like that but if we want to do something more professional we need to have the font actually installed on our computer and then go and do a better design in photoshop so i'm going to download the font no extra stuff, just immediately downloaded the font, then install this font on my computer. I'm using a Mac, but it works the exact same way on a Windows computer. You literally just double click and window prompts you install. So if I right click on the font, I hit open, and then it's going to do the installing thing. The same thing in Windows. So we have the regular version of this font. That's how it looks like. I'm gonna click install, and here we have the Pokemon. So now that we have the font installed, let's go ahead and open Photoshop. We have Photoshop open, so let's go ahead and grab some text Lore Pimpsum. hello so i'm going to then select the font up here i have selected ariel let's type in po -ke. pokemon regular right there it recognized it immediately so we're going to control t or command t make it a little bigger perfect let's replace it with the actual word poke no pokemon there we go we can change the color to a yellow and obviously we're in Photoshop so we can basically start playing around and doing whatever we want with it. Uh, if we want to put some borders, how do you put border? How to glow and then we give this whatever blue that is. I can obviously just take the exact color but right now this is just for demonstration purposes. You're the artist here. I'm just showing you how to install the font. All right, so you can play around now with your Pokemon font installed directly on Photoshop. Get the fonts from fontbold.com. They have so many others, movie fonts, music fonts, game fonts fonts, all sorts of things, anything that you can imagine. I hope you found this video helpful, and if you did, please leave a like and subscribe to the channel. Have a wonderful rest of the day, my friends, and stay safe out there.